The resurgence of Mbox, a global public health emergency on August 14, 2023, the World Health Organization WHO declared Mbox, formerly known as Monkeypox, a global public health emergency for the second time in two years. This declaration underscores the growing concern surrounding the ongoing outbreak, particularly in the Democratic Republic of Congo DRC and neighboring countries. Origins and transmission pox is a viral infection that causes flu-like symptoms and pus-filled lesions on the body. It is primarily transmitted through close contact with an infected individual, including skin-to-skin -skin contact, contact with bodily fluids, or contact with contaminated surfaces. The current outbreak in the DRC is attributed to the spread of an endemic strain of box, known as Clade I. However, a new variant, Cladib, has emerged and appears to spread more easily through routine close contact, including sexual contact. This new variant has raised concerns about increased transmissibility. Geographical spread The outbreak in the DRC has spread to neighboring countries, including Burundi, Kenya, Rwanda, and Uganda. The detection of cases in these countries, which have not previously reported in box, highlights the potential for further spread within Africa and beyond. Global Public Health Emergency In response to the evolving situation, the WHO convened an emergency committee on August 14 to assess the global risk posed by the Mpox outbreak. The committee unanimously agreed that the current upsurge of cases constitutes a public health emergency of international concern FIAC. This designation is WHO's highest level of alert and aims to accelerate research, funding, and international public health measures in cooperation to contain the disease. It also serves as a call for global action to address the outbreak. WHO Response WHO Director General Dr. Tedros Adhanom Ghebreyesus emphasized the need for a coordinated international response to stop the outbreaks and save lives. The organization has released US 1.5 million in contingency funds and plans to release more in the coming days. WHO's response plan requires an initial US 15 million, and the agency plans to appeal to donors for funding. The plan focuses on enhancing surveillance, laboratory diagnostics, infection prevention and control measures, and research and development of vaccines. Continental Concerns Earlier this week, Africa's top public health body, the Africa Centers for Disease Control and Prevention Africa CDC, declared an pox emergency for the continent. The CDC warned that the viral infection is spreading at an alarming rate, with more than 17 000 suspected cases and more than 500 deaths in 2024, mainly among children in Congo. Vaccines and prevention While no vaccines are currently available for Mpox, efforts are underway to develop and distribute them. WHO is working to identify target populations for vaccination and is appealing to countries with stockpiles of vaccines to donate shots. In addition to vaccines, behavior change is also crucial in preventing the spread of Mpox. WHO recommends avoiding close contact with infected individuals, isolating infected individuals, and practicing good hygiene measures. Conclusion The resurgence of Mpox as a global public health emergency highlights the importance of international collaboration and preparedness in addressing emerging health threats. WHO's declaration of a fiat calls for urgent action from countries, organizations, and individuals to contain the outbreak and protect global health.